עירובין משנה ו. לאחר שנתבאר שיעור הקורה, after we already know the measurement of the beam on top, באה המשנה ללמד שיעור הלח"י. This Mishnah comes to tell you how does the Lechi need to look like? What's his measurement? Rochbo ve'avyo, how wide it is to be, how thick it is to be. Lechayayin she'amru, when we say Lechayayin, Lechi, that they talked about, she'nechleku be'em chachamim ve'rabi Eliezer, we already learned that there's a disagreement between the sages and Rabbi Eliezer when it comes to the Lechayayin. שלדעת רבי אליעזר צריך לחיים, according to רבי אליעזר you need two of them. לכי מכאן ולכי מכאן, from both sides, בשני צידי הכניסה למבוי, in the two entrance way. ולדעת חכמים אין צורך אלא בלכי אחד, the sage says you only need one. בצד אחד בלבד של הכניסה למבוי, only in one side. So how tall do they have to be? What kind? How big the, the next, next measure? How big does the sign have to be? You have to make a sign. How big does the sign have to be? So he tells you how big, Gavhan Asarat Fachim. The bigness of the sign, how big it has to be, it has to be ten Fachim. Ten Fachim is about one meter, it's not that big. One meter. Three feet. No, no, it's Lechi, it's not Korah. Well, from the Lechi, there's connection. It's at Asarat Fachim, how are you going to connect the top to it? No? Do you remember the... Something Do you remember between the two houses? So you all, according to the, the oh, opinion, so you need a lechi. You put the houses and then on the side you put the sarat fachim as a key. Word. That's right. You so notice that when they make... It doesn't have to be connected. Oh, very good. It has to be on top, not connected. Okay. But it has to be at least ten fachim. That's the measurement. Why? Ten fachim makes a mechitza. Okay. Ten fachim is a mechitza. It makes it into a domain. Makes it into a Tefach is a... זה תפח. זה כמו בסוכה, לא? יא, 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 exactly the same thing. All the laws are exactly the same. Exactly the same. גבהן עשרה טפחים. כלומר, שאפילו עושה שני לחיים כדעת רבי אליעזר, which means even if you make two door posts, like רבי אליעזר, מכל מקום צריכים הם להיות גבוהים לכל הפחות עשרה טפחים. The minimum measurement has to be at least ten. You can make it more, but at least ten. כשיעור גובה המבוי, because that's what makes the height of, a, of the מבוי, of the street, שכן אין הכשרו של מבוי בלחי או בקורה, אלא אם כן הוא גבוה לכל הפחות עשרה טפחים. So it, it, it says, otherwise it's, it's, not even a, it's, it's not even an opening, you don't even need it. Yeah? ברם, אפילו היה מבוי גבוה מעשרה טפחים. What happens if the מבוי is very very tall? It's 20 tfachim, 30 tfachim. Dayo lach shiro belechi shu gavu asara tfachim. It doesn't matter. As long as you have the lechi. 10 tfachim, that's already made it kosher. In other words, it's the minimum. Once it's kosher, it's kosher. You can, if you want to go all the way up, go all the way up. You don't need to. It's already a mechitza. What do you call the rest of it? It's a window. You're allowed to have a window. So called. Yeah? Okay. Verachban, how wide that it has to be? אביין של לחיי, it says כלשהו, and how wide? any measurement is good. there's no measurement. any measurement is good. בגמרא אמרו וכמה כלשהו, it says how much is anything? so the Gemara asks, what do you mean anything? anything? what do you mean? a fishing line? a fishing line is good enough? how much is anything? it says אפילו כחוט הסרבל. it says even if it's a rope. yeah, does it? it cannot be a fishing line. But chuta sarbal is min beged avesh ayu lovshim beyameheim. It's a thick clothing that they used to wear in those times. Yesh mevarim she chuta sarbal ukeov yetzba. It's like a one finger, one finger length. Yeah, nothing much. In other words, it it has to be seen a little bit. It cannot be a fishing line. Yeah, something that you can look at this normal. Yesh mefarshim afilu pachot meov yetzba. Some say even less than an yetzba. כלומר משהו ממש, אוקיי? רבי יוסי אומר, רבי יוסי says, רוחבן שלושה טפחים. רבי יוסי says, no, 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 no. It needs to have some kind of normal measurement. How much is a normal measurement? שלושה טפחים. three טפחים, which is about 
30, a tefach is about 10 centimeters, so 30 centimeters, whatever it is, 30 centimeters, how many feet? It's one feet, right? 10 centimeters? 30 centimeters, it's about what, two feet? But I don't know yet, okay. So, il va'alechi hu mishu mechitza, it says because the lechi has to be it has to be an oak, like a wall. It has to be like a wall. That's right. It needs to be a little bit important. You can't have a rope over there. Therefore, it is not kosher only if it has the width of three tfachim. Anything is gone. In other words, there's a vikuach over here. Okay. What is, is right about the Vikuch, you, 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 you remember our explanation in the beginning, there's two reasons why you need it. One reason is a sign, the other reason it, it makes the Mechitza. It is a Mechitza already, so even if it's not a sign, I don't care. If it makes the Mechitza... It doesn't function as a sign. Rabbi Yossi Omer, that's it, why he's saying that Rabbi Yossi. Or it's, yeah, it's not a sign, what are you guys doing? Or, or, Maybe that's what Rabbi Yossi, maybe that's the machloket between the two. Okay.